Some really inspiring music there, huh? Went from Mega Man and Ninja Gaiden to to this. Uh, no. <laughs> yeah. Hey, everybody. Uh, welcome back. Uh, first show of the week this week. Uh, out of town last uh, yesterday, so Wednesday is the day of choice today. We'll be on tomorrow, too. Um, but um, before we get started in the show... Uh, I want to tell you that we went to, uh, last weekend, we went to a, a Daytona for the the Daytona Arcade Museum over in their little downtown Riverside area, and uh, it, was, uh, it was a pretty cool place. I was really impressed by it. It, like, had just opened up, like, that month and caught wind of it, and uh, it's actually built in an old theater that was, like, made in the 50s, so it's, uh... It's, like, chock full of old games. I'd say most of them are, what would you say, like, early 80s? Yeah, like, there wasn't, there was, like, only a couple games from the 90s, I'd say, or something. Yeah, yeah. Uh, so you won't really find, like, uh, you know, things like Mortal Kombat and Street Fighter and things like that, X-Men, stuff like that, but they did have a good selection of older games uh, that... That one we were playing on Neo Geo Machine, playing Gauntlet, which goes on forever. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, like, there's one part where, like, we waited so long that all the walls turned into exits. Yeah. I don't know if that was just particular, or they're just like, oh, they're just going to wait forever, let's give them a way out. But, um, we took advantage of it, and that was nice. Um, it's weird, because, like, the opening of the place is like a jewelry store. Yeah, yeah, that was really weird. They're trying to do a couple things, but I mean, once you get inside, it's cool. You see, you see, like in the background, they got like the '80s music videos playing on the screen. They got a little bar. They go buy pizza and beer and stuff like that. And it's like twenty bucks to get in for the day, and you know, you just play all day. You know, no quarters after that. Yeah, and there's pizza and stuff too. Mm mm-hmm. They actually had this cool little section, like a museum, because it is a museum. But uh, they had some of the E.T. games and Atari games from the dig out in the desert, you know. And uh, they had quite a few of them, actually. There's whole, like, like stacks of Warlords all smashed up and everything. And uh, it was cool to actually see that little piece of gaming history there. Yeah, and then there was also those, like, in the near the movie theater part, there's, like, a bunch of Ataris and Nintendos or whatever. Mm-hmm. And you were playing... E.T. there. Yeah, yeah, they had uh, Atari, they had a uh, Genesis, they had a Nintendo, and you can see it in the back there where it says Grand Opening, um, like all the little TVs, they have all these old TVs with systems hooked up to it, and um, I don't know, what would you say your favorite game was? Um, there was a really cool Vector one that I like where... Oh, yeah. Uh, what was that one called? Like... Space Duel or something like that. Something very generic in the 80s or 70s. Yeah. But the art's really cool on those, aren't they? Yeah, it was like really surreal looking at those. Mm hmm. It's like, that's not anything like any TV screen I've seen. <laughs> it's very crisp yeah. graphics. But, um, they had a, one of my favorite games was Bump and Jump there. I just played that a lot growing up. Uh, a lot of pinball machines uh, that you saw. Um, yeah, like a quarter of the whole place is pinball machines. Yeah, and I mean, they had like some newer ones, but most of them were like, you know, 70s, and they had like way back, you know, where it was like fully mechanical, even the, the scoreboard's mechanical. Um, another vector based one they had there was a Star Wars cabinet one. You played that one. Yeah, that was pretty good. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but uh, anyway, it's a cool place. If you're ever in Daytona and. Um, you got some free time, free day, spend the day. It's, it's an awesome way. You, they put an armband on you so you can come and go all day. Um, you'll have to check it out if you're over there. Yeah. Not bad at all. I just hope that they keep adding, you know, games to it. You know, I'd love to see some 90s stuff in there. Yeah. It seemed like they're going to probably have to take up some pinball machines out of there, though. Mm-hmm. They not fit any more. Yeah, they were kind of already maxed out. I, I forget how many games it was, like, a hundred, about including yeah. pinball, but um, definitely seeing you know, Frogger, um, 
couple Tron games, a couple co- cocktail tables. Not bad at all. All right. Speaking of games, uh, today's game is it's the letter O for Operation Wolf. And, uh... It's me! <laughs> we have a special guest today. It's, it's a Mario. <laughs> uh, Operation Wolf is a, uh... It's a light gun game, technically, but you can play it with a controller. Uh, unfortunately, this whole restricting ourselves to the alphabet thing puts us at a disadvantage sometimes when we get the letters. There's not too many O games for NES. It was like that or Othello, and that was about it. What was Othello like? It's just Othello. It's like you know the, the black, you know the game that they played and in, in lost. You know, black and white. It's a board game, pretty much. So I don't remember that. No. Nah. No. Nope. Well, you ready to get this thing underway? I am. All right, let's fire it up. On the music, and here we go. You can go first. Okay. Mm-hmm. How you play this? Okay. Let's see. Um, gun sight speed. I'm gonna increase that. Let's go at least faster. Yeah. I, that's optimal for 360 no scoping. Right. <laughs> Uh, okay, this is not, and we're doing the communication center first. Don't let them call for help. Jeez. Make them all pay. We have seven magazines, so National Geographic, Time Magazine, and five grenades. Good luck! You're gonna go take on an entire army. Go get them. Okay. You got this. Oh, you just used your name. I did. Throw a grenade at that copter. I love that damage bar. They're like, uh... Yeah, we ran out of space. We ran out of space. We should give them a little bit more. Hey, watch out with the grenades. Crap. See, these games, like... It's always felt like you can't really even avoid the damage. You just take it. And I hope to God that it's not something that could kill you. Hey, dude, with the grenades. How come they get so many grenades? Didn't you know every soldier is equipped to have at least one grenade? Boom. I like how their... Their souls are lighting up a little bit. I think that's some firing at me. Are you sure? I'm already dying. Nah, you're fine. I don't feel fine. Well, there's no, no pain, no gain. No, we gotta just uh, take the heat. If I shoot the nurses, no. Uh, oh. Um, uh, Did that hurt me. What's it? You just shot a bird. Yeah, they give me. This help. isn't duck hunt. Uh oh. Oh man, that's your Geiger counter going off. I don't have any ammo. I'm fading out. You have sustained a lethal injury. Sorry. But you were finished here. Is that what they're saying to you? <laughs> Somebody's telling me this. They're standing over me. Uh, yeah, you continue. Make sure you press A. Okay. Uh, okay. Bullet hit rate 20%. It's pretty terrible. And you clear rate 83%. All right, we got it. Oh. Oh. Okay. Uh, which one was yes? Does it really matter? I mean, it's it's just like now we're gonna just do a different place. We Are didn't we? make any progress on that. I don't think it lets us choose a different place. Are you sure? Oh, you're right. Yeah. We well, got... I don't think there was any checkpoints anyway, so right. I don't think so. I guess try to conserve your ammo, and maybe you get the thing sped up too fast. It's hard to aim. Oh my god, how do you aim with this? Oh, you get the hang of it. How did you... This is way too fast. What are you... <laughs> uh, what is 
wrong with you? The birds do give you power-ups. Because there's birds walking around with magazines and grenades. Flying around. Sorry. These are grenades, man. I don't know. How do you do that? The other button? Oh, the start button? No. Oh, I got it. I'm already almost dead. Do they give you health? Uh, eventually. Please. Get, shoot that ammo because you need it. Oh, you shot the glass. Oh, bad? that's health. The peak. There you go. You were almost dead. Now you're still almost dead. I'm just going to use all my grenades. What? Oh no. Use this glass. What is that? Hello. That's not good. That was helpful. Oh, I missed one. Don't shoot the nurses. Oh. I don't know why they're, there's like a full on firefight and they're just like, ooh, what's that free thing? Go! Oh, grenade! Oh my god, no. I don't know if it did any better or worse than you. Was that the same spot? How come we have so much gray hair? Like, I don't feel like we should be the one and only doing this. Hey, you, you commies, I'll get you next time. Look at that, 45% fire rate. You did, you did a lot better than I did. You need to change the aim thing. That is, uh... Is it too fast? Yeah, that's not, that's not good. I have to have lightning fast reflexes, though. It's not like we're out there going, All right, there he is, over there, hold on, just wait for it. Oh, he moved. <laughs> All right, I'll change it to fastest. Slowest. We'll just do medium. Yeah, I'll do that. That's fine. I imagine, would this game be easier or harder with the light gun? I think it would be easier because you could actually like aim better. Uh, Are those things really that good at uh, registering your shots? Yeah. I mean, and uh, getting them in the right spots. Don't use up all your grenades. Ah. It's like little pigs in the background. Yeah, so this game is a uh, pure madness. Yeah. Oh, you killed the nurse, I think. Uh oh. Shame on you. Shame. Well, you know what? Shame. That's how it goes. Don't be out there running around with an empty gurney. Yeah, you got a point. <laughs> you shot everywhere around that guy before you shot him. <laughs> Headshot. Ooh, head. Uh, toe shot. What's this noise? I think that's like telling you that you're low on health. Oh, don't. Oh. Did you complete it? <laughs> what? And we're done. We almost got to the end both times? I guess so. That's ridiculous. Literally, like, we got right to that outhouse, and then we died. Every time. We didn't even get to demolish it. We just didn't get to see a cut... Not even really a cut scene. Just a drawing of a guy, like, on the toilet. Shooting. Just watching an explosion from the distance. Extract information about the prison camp location from the enemy. We'll just get, we'll just gather those monkeys. Two, Two magazines. Two magazines? You can do it. Where the BMW is Is that a chicken? Yeah, chickens are my, are my big, uh, oh, I killed something. <laughs> well, no way, you killed something? I love how the chickens don't die. Like, I can destroy a tank and whatever. Uh, oh, crap. Whoa, I'm, like, really dying. Oh, my God. Oh, crap. oh, don't kill the villagers, I guess. I like how some of the soldiers just go around shooting and walking at the same time. And then other ones just stand still. 
I have no ammunition left. Let's join the prisoners. Yeah, like they're gonna let me live after that, right? Oh, so if you run out of ammunition, you just die. Press A. Okay, good. Well, what do we, what do we expect with two magazines? Well, now we get five magazines. I Maybe guess they it's continued based off on. Of, yeah. yeah, it's based off of how many you lost. Like, last look time. at your damage, just like racking up. Oh, I could just all of them go away. Keep shooting the, the ammo. Use your grenades on those things. They're just like super killing you. It's true. I think you do get more damage if you shoot a villager. I feel like, uh. I feel like, uh, I don't know if you remember that movie Toys. Uh. Yeah. Where, where Dumbledore is playing the arcade game. And he's like a tank game. And he's like, oh, you lost a thousand points because you shot a UN truck. It's like, damn, UN. Doesn't know. <laughs> they have no right to be there. Is that Pete? Is that Pete? Oh, uh, I need that. Oh, that was health. Thank God. Oh! You're out of ammo. Yeah, one bullet oh. left. Oh, my God. That right. one bullet Conserve. gathered me many. Shoot, shoot all that stuff. Uh oh. Oh, that was wood. Wood explodes if you didn't know. Get the, get the ammo, get the ammo, you're down two bullets. What? No! Oh no. Did I die? You died. Oh. Darn. Yeah. Man, I, I felt like that was probably close to that one. We have no clue who's going. I was just judging it based off of uh, how long the other map was. Mm. And your history is intercept and intelligence. Yes. I don't think it's going to let me continue. It's not. All right. So, I think we're going to have to cheat. How are we going to cheat? With save states. Okay. You know that? Was it speed okay? Yeah, that was fine. Yeah, that wasn't nearly as bad as the other one. But, uh... Yeah. Yeah, it seems kind of like an... Does our guy just like, like he goes onto a parachute and he just like falls right on top of like, he just goes onto the ground and he starts shooting everything? No, I just hit the wrong button. I was just firing grenades at Willy Nilly. Who is Willy Nilly? He is not very um, conservative. <laughs> Grenade! Can you stop those? Yeah, you can shoot the grenades. Yeah, shooting grenades. Always been a a thing in good practice, you know. Done. Dead. Wait, 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 wait. Don't hit the nurses. Yeah, I know. How do you know how much ammo you have? It's all that stuff at the bottom. Which is which? Well, something is one thing, and another thing is another thing. Um, I guess that means you have five magazines left? Now four? Almost there! Get him! Get the grenade! Oh, that was health actually. Please stop shooting! Stop it! I gotta kill everything. But you're wasting our ammo for the next stage. I think you're almost there. I, I don't know anymore, actually. I thought I was pretty sure that passing that house was the almost there point, but now it's. Hit your windows. Oh! oh. And one more hit. Oh no. Oh, watch it. Oh. oh, come on. We were there. I 
feel like we should have said no on that continue, but I feel like we wasted a continue. Just to start back at the beginning. I don't know. I feel like it hit everything around the helicopter. Is that how grenades work? They just instantly explode whatever you're looking at? Yep. Alright. Get in that ammo. I think I'm almost out of ammo already. I, yeah, I'm out of, I'm like, I have one clip left. What is that even? It didn't do anything. It didn't give me grenades, it didn't give me ammo, it didn't give me health. Alright, I'm gonna say that we, um, because I feel like we're just gonna be looking at the same level over and over again. Let's game genie this thing. How do we do that? Um... You know, I've never had to do it on here. But I feel like there's a way. Is there a way that we don't ever take any damage? Yes, there is with the game genie. Um... All right. Like cheat and cheat. Uh, hmm. Are you gonna have to put in the code thing? I don't know. With plus. Guys, our our NES is much more advanced <laughs> than any other NES has ever come to light. Yes. Um. Maybe we don't get to in this one, which would suck. Push start I wonder if I could just do it this way. Here guys. I'm gonna let you if you wanna just keep playing for a little bit. Am I able to? Oh yeah, okay. Go, go. Yeah, it's not like you're doing it. No. Oh, because I'm doing this right here? Yeah. Just do it really fast. Okay. So, um, Operation Wolf. Have you ever played this as a kid? Me? Yes. I want to say I have. But, if I did, it didn't stick with me. Hmm. How do you know this stuff is actually doing anything? Um, we're gonna find out in a second. Strapping them boots in. Checking them pockets. Uh, checking them Uzis. Do you want to be the first to test these? Um, Since I died last time, I guess. Sure. All right. Okay. I don't know if this is going to work or not. Probably not, but... I don't know. What did you put in? Uh, Never Die and Infinite Magazines. But... Hmm. Like I said, I don't know if it's ever going to work. Hey, Gavin. How's it going, man? Seven magazines? Is that... Is that a normal amount? Oh. I feel like I should have left. Well, you're taking damage. Uh, it's all each. My, my magazines are going on. Okay. Oh yeah, they're, they're stuck at 8. So I think they worked. That's pretty nice. 
Yeah, we're just gonna see what this game does as we go through. Cause it'll be boring <laughs> just to watch the first level. You just do. You get zero percent kill kills the entire time. You just yeah. do that. I just sit here and I don't even have to fire. Yeah. <laughs> I just shoot one guy and then I get a hundred percent kills. Yeah, just uh. <laughs> just imagine it like just a soldier just walking by like just getting all these bullets just hey guys how's it going <laughs> yeah you actually have nine clips now yeah I collected some oh oh how you been Gavin been up to anything what have you been playing lately Ooh. hey stop shooting the glass Apparently it's, it's bad. I want I want to get hit a lot. I want to see if I die. Nope. I just keep on ticking. Alright, I'm going to add one more. Here you finish off the level. Or you can't. It'll just keep going. But we're going to have a little bit more fun with this. Yeah, let's just... We might as well just put down the controller and just sit back and <laughs> We're going to add infinite grenades. Oh, that's a good one, actually. Because we can... The power. Oop. Yeah, that's the wrong section. Uh, mm -hmm. Um... A little bit of everything. Everything is my favorite video game. Alright, we have infinite grenades now? I don't know. It, it... Nope, we don't. <laughs> Here, let's, let's do this. I'll have to activate it. Now try it. Nope. Hmm. You know what's crazy? Is it's just going on forever. Here, I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna restart. And we'll, uh... Oh my god, it's gonna take forever getting back there. I think, I think you actually have to hit a certain level of, like, stuff. You know, like, it's not just going to let us coast through the whole thing. So, let's see how our grenade situation works. Yeah, maybe you ended the game so early last time because you killed so many guys, I guess? Yeah, I think it has, like, targets for you. You know, it's got, like, five tanks. You have to destroy five tanks. All right, just throw off your grenades. Just oh, yeah, look at this. Oh, yeah, mass destruction. <laughs> I love you, Game Genie. I love you. This is great. This is how every game should be. You know, I've I used to have a game genie. Oh, you killed the nurses. Oh, I took damage for that because it's there's no way I could actually it's damage in here. It hurt your soul. Oh, oh my soul! <laughs> what have I done? I'm not gonna lose sleep. Oh, oh my god! <laughs> I've killed four nurses today. Oh Six no! Six nurses today. No. <laughs> so many. Oh. I'm grenade this freaking bird. <laughs> oh my god, nurses. Okay, so... Let's take out these windows. We don't need those. Oh, it's like... Nine, two, okay, there's a countdown. We have to take all these down to zero before it takes us on to the next level. So... so oh, I see. So we got three more guys to kill. So, Gavin, uh, we're playing Operation Wolf today. Um... It's a zapper shooter, but uh, they let you play with a controller. So, it, like I said in the beginning of the show, really not too many O options. So, yeah. Uh, Who knew that like the NES allows? Did you know the NES is portable with Xbox controllers? It's, like it was future compatible. I mean, that's that's really they they really thought ahead with that. They did. They did. All right, what do we gotta get? Extract junk information. We get nine magazines, infinite grenades. Okay, we have to kill 60 guys? Good lord. That's quite a bit, game. It is quite a bit. But, I mean, we... Gavin, we, we decided to go the... the Game Genie route because we played the first level like six times and we weren't getting anywhere. So we're like, you know what? No one wants to see just the first level over and over again. So we're gonna... Shift things in our favor a little bit, you know God. what I'm saying? These freaking civilians, why would you run into a man who has infinite grenade grenades, alright, guys? 
These you know? chickens don't know what's up. The chickens can't dive, you know? It's sad. They just get hit and they move about. Why is that thing with video game chickens? You can't really kill. Like Fable, you can kill the chickens. You can just hit them. What's another game? I feel like if you attack the chicken, it'll come after you. Oh my god, that guy had a hostage. He's surrendering. He's like, I give, dude. I give. You are clearly worthy. Unworthy. Unworthy. All right, you can do the next one. All right. Which one's the grenade button? That's all I need. Uh, the location of the prison camp was extracted from the enemy. Ew. Now I have dark hair. We had gray hair and when we died. Yeah. Our guy gets older for every bullet he gets hit with. Mm. They're bullets that aged you. Uh oh. They've come, they're, they're on the offense now. They yeah. are prepared. What if, uh, what if they made bullets in the future so that instead of them actually hurting you, like, from your insides, they'll just make you older for every bullet you took? That would be the most powerful weapon. It's like a fireworks show. Man, these guys... I'm, I'm gonna let some of these guys see what they do. Oh, I'm trying, man. I like the, these guys, the karate guys. And they're doing like ninja rolls. They're like choreographed too. <laughs> they're like dancers. Ninjas. Ninjas. <laughs> I'll pop you guys some off of the machine gun a little bit there. Oh, you guys didn't make it against guard mode. I almost, I almost thought that you, that you like died there, <laughs> but I thought again. Uh, okay, clear this scene. We gotta talk in like NES voice. Of course, clear scene. <laughs> What's wrong with your NES voice? That's... It sounds like it has asthma. That's what NES voice sounds like. Yeah. So. Dude, man, man, man. <laughs> You're basically belong to us. <laughs> so we are full on. Those just watching, full on in the game genie mode. We just want to get through this game just to see what it looks like. Quit That's saying this is game genie mode. This is clearly us at yeah. maximum skill level. Yeah, we're just we kill pigs. We can't kill pigs either. Look at them. They just back and forth, back and forth. Clearly, farm animals oh. have ascended among ooh, humans. Ooh, ooh, he ooh. just headshotted that civilian. Oh, I'm sorry. I was going for the pig. That's a different constellation. Dancing pig. Ooh. The pig doesn't know what to do. Uh, uh, He's just like popping a little in the butt, and then it just poops out bullets. <laughs> Here, See, these soldiers are smart. They know that you have grenades, so they sit right next to the civilians. Oh, I don't care about civilians. This is, I mean, if, if, this, was, if this was real life, we would be saying different, but this is a, a video game from 1989. That is true. This is a video game from 1989. Yes, not real life. We can, detain, we can detain the difference. Oh, hey, we're hanging out. The village is free. You recovered from injury. Wasn't injured? I'm God. I'm the God soldier. Captain America. Ammo, ammo dump. This is where we dump our ammo. Or this is where ammunition uses the bathroom. This is where the ammunition goes to die. This guy's huge. <laughs> I mean, he's like twice the size of the other guys. Look, they're running away from him. <laughs> yeah. How many? I gotta kill forty. Oh, sorry, I killed the nurses. Like I said, nurses. Why are you running into like a battle with an empty gurney? You know, maybe there's just like a really tiny person in there. You know, there was one of the um, game genie things. It was like infinite energy drinks. Like, Red Bull's going to keep us going. I've been shot 50 times, but this energy drink is helping me keep going. This energy drink is giving me the energy to go on with my life. Hey, Gavin, you didn't catch us for the, the Mega Man episode, did you? I don't think I saw you on there. Yeah, we were so lonely. 
No, we had company. Oh, that one's done. Yeah, we had like another person there. Yeah, that he, was great. He was in the Mega Man, but um, we got pretty far, and we we didn't use Game Genie. We did use some save states. Um, but yeah. we did, we got to Wiley's before the hour was up, so, um, and then we just stopped there, but that was, that was a pretty good, pretty good run. Yeah. What was your favorite stage on that one? Um. You hate Metal Man, don't you? Because he's got the blocks. Or does he? He has the blocks. The lava, the heat man or whatever. Oh, yeah, heat man with the lava, yeah. That one took a few times. Yeah, um, my favorite... Oh, he's a zombie! Look at him! He's... Oh, he's posing. Oh, my God. I'm trying to think of it. There's, like, one that was, like, super, super easy that you did. I don't remember what. I think it was probably, like, wooden. Oh, God! Something. What's happening? Did I just... Did he just go to heaven? Wait, no. What? He's going to heaven! We're shooting... Oh, send him! Man, we really are God now. <laughs> Godly beings of the future. Can I shoot him back down? No. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> what is wrong with you? I, I, I'm getting a little, getting a little crazy from the power trip I'm on right now. Oh, I'm not letting you play anymore. Here, here, go, go kill some things. Like, go kill some things, son. All right, Mario, son. Mario. Woo! Yeah, just smash B button. Mm hmm. We'll just, we'll just sit here. No, you got 15 <laughs> times. We'll just get, this base will go on infinitely. I want to see how long it goes on. It will for. go on infinitely. I want to see if it loops. It, I, I think it's just a, it's a big door. I think we, we've seen that door. It's like they, they Flintstone it. You don't remember the Flintstones, do you? I know all about the things. That's what they would do with the backgrounds. They would run through their house and like go on forever and ever and ever and ever. They'd run by the same stone couch and window. <sighs> all right, you did good. You know, you sent a lot of tortured POWs to heaven. This game's weird now. The fact that they added the angel wings thing and it's out of my hands. Oh no, I feel like. This is just a delusion of someone that's like gone overboard or something, and they're like, I'll send you to heaven! You're free! This is like a grandpa retelling his tales into like war or whatever. Like, and then I killed a, every single person with 50 grenades, and then also every one of the guys I accidentally killed those grenades went into heaven. Good luck. You gotta say it like a guy from Star Fox. Good luck. <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> hey, motorcycles. Are these guys going to heaven too? They are. That's weird, man. That's weird. I don't know. I think it's... Uh, you know, I, it appeals to Christian audiences. Yeah, like, we didn't hurt them. You didn't hurt them, buddy. You sing them on. I'll never know. I'll just just go into circles with grenades. I mean, who's gonna stop this? I love the count. Like it counts down. Like you gotta kill five more helicopters and twenty-three more dudes, and it's just like that's when I feel like I've done a good enough job. I'm not gonna feel my bloodlust until I kill twenty-three more dudes and four birds. Yeah. Now what's going on? Oh, these are the boss. Maybe. Yeah, I guess it was. Well, that was that was a nice boss. Oh, is this? I think this might be the end of the game. Yeah, did we beat it? I think you have to hit button now. <sighs> a successful getaway, but 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 ellipses. All the prisoners are dead. What? All of them? Really? We killed all of them? What? What happened? Is that Charleston Heston? <laughs> he looks really mad. There's gonna be... He's gonna be uh, harassed by some interviewers look. for the NRA. Hey, look, man. You sent us over there by ourselves. We had to make a deal with the devil. 
have infinite grenades. What was that? Bullet hit rate zero percent. Yeah. Enemy clear rate ninety nine percent. Hey, you didn't say anything. Well, maybe the freaking prisoners shouldn't be like just you know pouncing around. Yeah, uh, I think we should. What the heck? How was that a game over? That's a game over. Ninety nine percent of the prisoners are dead. Uh, we, uh, you just sent a nuclear bomb, a walking nuclear bomb, to destroy the POWs. Yeah. Do the nurses count as prisoners? Because they feel like they're working with the enemy. That... Those nurses could have been holding, like, little tiny Swiss army knives or whatever. You can never be too safe here, right? Wow. Okay. You know, I, I think I said, I'm not, you know, if you, if you didn't give me those parameters before that I couldn't <laughs> kill the, the prisoners, then, you know, I, I feel like that's a, a failure of your part. Is there a cheat? Mr. Charleston Heston, President. Is there a cheat so that we can not ever accidentally kill a prisoner? You know what? It might be. Uh. Could we get through this game in like 10 minutes? No. We could skip to, we can start on mission six. You want to do that? Sure. All, All right. right. Just don't ever use don't, the grenades. Don't ever use the grenade. That's We're going to see what the good ending's like. Um, <laughs> He's going to be like, you skipped the level six. Get, why did you even bother? <laughs> no shortcuts in life, soldier. <laughs> So, I want you to get back into those POW camps right now! Oh, <laughs> uh, okay. Uh, S, Z. Where am I at here? I used to, you should read them out loud so then anybody who, else, who wants to play Operation Wolf can gather these codes for themselves. Alright, I'll let you go for it. Okay. Uh, oh, wait. Uh, wait a minute. Yeah. It could, it could start on. No. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah. Okay. All right. That was the second to last one. No, this is the last one. Oh. Okay. Just don't kill any freaking prisoners. Pew pew. Yeah, pew, or pew pew. Pew 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 pew. He's like, I like you're one soldier. I want you to go kill eighty one guys and a helicopter and eleven helicopters and three tanks. But don't don't get any of the prisoners that are just running around. But don't get too close to the edge. Yeah, that's bad. Do birds count? Are birds prisoners? <laughs> These birds are prisoners of war. We gotta save the birds. Those damn doves are wanting us to save the birds. Alright, you gotta, don't worry about any more tanks. Just let them drive by. Yes. Yeah, I'll just sit and just shoot the middle of the screen until they line up and get hit by that. I, f I feel like, um... You, you're okay to use the grenades on the helicopters because they're up there, you know. I don't even see any. Uh, have you seen any of the prisoners yet? No, but you can never be sure because they just wander around like crazy, crazy zombie. Hmm. Careful, careful. Bam, bam, bam. Thirty-seven to go. These guys are taking a while. I know. It's crazy we can't use your... Twenty-six? Hmm. Yeah. Could you imagine just like a soldier with like a billion grenades in his like pockets or whatever? Just like... Eh, 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 eh. <laughs> That's how they speak. These, these how cargo go. pants. Cargo pants hold anything. Get that helicopter. You got seven of those guys to get. Fine. Wait, are these motorcycles? Oh, okay. Never mind. They're, they're, thought, shooting they're shooting at us. I thought for a second there, I thought those were good guys. Alright, all you got left is helicopters. Just keep on the helicopters. Alright, this should be, yeah, last one. All right, come on, good ending. Good ending. You got to buddy. What? What? 
What the heck? Dude, you have been drinking the crazy sauce. Is it really? We didn't kill my one. All right. We need to we need to figure this out. How do we get it so we haven't killed a single prisoner? That right there. We haven't killed a single one. But, like, there must be a specific thing we're missing here. Like, maybe... Maybe, like... Maybe it actually was the birds weren't supposed to be ever hit or something. I don't know. I don't know. I'm ready to call it, though, because I'm, I'm not giving you any more, more of my time, Charleston Heston, President. Why do you think it looks like Charles Heston? Charleston Heston, because it does. He's like, uh... Not for my cold, dead hands, you know? He's actually holding me up his hands. But, um, yeah, so that was um, Operation Wolf for the NES. And um, it had its moments, but... Um, they, should, they should have called it Operation Don't Bother Coming Home. Yeah, you'll never please your bosses. <laughs> Operation Never Please Your Bosses. <laughs> Because, you know, they expect too much. <laughs> that's really. A, that's a great operation <laughs> name. If that was like, imagine, you know, like in XCOM, they had it so like every mission was like, you know, they had like a special little name for it, like Operation of Tombstone or whatever. <laughs> that would be like Operation Don't Bother Coming Home. <laughs> that's uh, the Operation All the Prisoners Are Dead. <laughs> operation un- Unacceptable Standards. Yeah, that was... Um, but, um, <laughs> that's a close one. Anyway, so, uh, Gavin, I don't think you're here for the intro, but we were talking about, um, this last weekend we went to, uh, the Daytona Arcade Museum up in, you guessed it, Daytona, and, uh, it was a pretty cool place. It was, it's actually an old movie theater, uh, from the 1950s that they converted over. Uh, they got, like, tons of games from the 80s, about, about early 80s, mid 80s, nothing from the 90s. But um, still some good ones, things like Frogger and da-da-da and all of those, lots of pinball. Um, that's us playing ga- uh, nah, Galaga. Right. Yeah. That's Galaga right there. Galaga. <laughs> don't, Gauntlet. Don't zoom in on that. That's Galaga. He's lying. Yeah. And, um, yeah, yeah, so it was a cool place. They, they had, like, the museum, like, they had a bunch of old systems, like, under glass, and then, you know, some of the, the E.T., dig out from the desert games and um see that back row of tvs under the grand opening sign those they had some system set up like in sega genesis and then yes uh and then 2600 an N- nba jam wasn't playable because you weren't able to pass the basketball to yeah your... the controller they had that was broken but um you know still you could be a good assist character there yeah you could just pass the ball yeah, just pass the ball. Just, I, you'll I, never become the star of the show, but, you know. I love, like, when I was, like, the one with the controller that actually was able to shoot, I just kept on passing it back to you. <laughs> I'm like, like, I can't do nothing. Yeah. That's yeah. Can yeah. turbo. But anyway, so, uh, yeah, it's a cool place. If you ever, um, you know, convince your mom to go up there, or maybe next time we go, you know, we'll see if you, you can go with us. But, um... It's a, it was a cool place, for sure. Um, anyway, so that's that's about it for today. Tomorrow is OP. P. Um, what are we playing for P? Paperboy um, or... Paperboy. I don't know. I, what, is, what is Paperboy? Uh, remember... Remember uh, the Back to the Future NES game? Where you're running down the street, sort of, diagonally. Yeah. It's like that, but better. It's like they were emulating Paperboy, I think. You just deliver mm. newspapers, I think. I don't, I don't remember, honestly. Well, that's a blur. That sounds fine to me. Mm-hmm. All right. So, uh, that's it for this one. It's kind of a shorter episode, but kind of a shorter game. So, it is what it is. Yep. Can't please the president, Charleston Heston. He's just, I mean, look at him. He just, he can't, look, he, there's no way you could please that guy. I just sort of want to do it again just so I could see his happy face. But he, his happy face is going to, 
Ha- Happy Face is gonna be the same thing, but it's just gonna have like different text on the side. Like, good job, soldier. You did great. <laughs> yeah, he's just yelling that <laughs> in a disapproving tone. <laughs> good job, god damn it. <laughs> Thank you, President Charles and Heston. All right, so, all right, so the next episode is gonna be tomorrow night um, at nine, and we'll figure out what game it's gonna be, but it's probably gonna be the Paper Boy. So. Yeah. It's time for bed. <laughs> Bedtime. Anyway, so, uh, all right. Gavin, thanks for joining us, and uh, we'll see you next time on, not there, but here, Alphabet's, Alphabet's Retro. Retro.